On Monday I gave a talk about how we best use some of the agents we have available for us now in the management of Hodgkin's lymphoma when patients have failed a previous autologous stem cell transplant. So we know that overall about 50% of patients will fail an autologous transplant. These patients are very, then very difficult to treat. We may be wanting to try and get these patients to an allogeneic stem cell transplant if they're young enough and fit enough. Fortunately, in the current era, we now have a number of novel agents that we can use in this setting, including brentaxamab, vedotin, including the checkpoint inhibitors, nivolumab, and soon we'll be able to use pembrolizumab as well. So we can use these different agents in this setting. We can also use more conventional chemotherapy and radiotherapy options as well. And what you're trying to do is then get a response in the patient and try and get them to the transplant. Of course, if the patient isn't uh, an allogeneic stem cell transplant candidate, you may be thinking about a more palliative strategy, but again, you can use these different agents to provide uh, palliation for the patient.